if your hometown is also your first lesson in love, then it will not surprise you to learn that I am an expert in longing. I know I am never the only lover, that there is a good chance my name won't ring a bell if you ask of me tomorrow. I know every ode I attempt has been written before, that where I belong does not belong to me. Let me confess, it is true. I am always dizzy with motion. Sleep is that good drug I read about in a doctor's office but have never tried. And yes, my traffic is constant. And yes, I am addicted to flux, desperate for the high of discovery, scared to be caught wearing the same corner store twice. We inherit the vices of those who infatuate us. So I too have the habit of blushing and spinning before tourists that whisper, will you look at that? Can you blame me? Sometimes litter feels less like trash when a foreigner wants to photograph it. I can tell who is trying to capture me. I know who is looking for a souvenir with which they can return to a safe town boasting of the time they braved my dangers, confident that they understand my strangeness now. I let them. It makes the loneliness rattle a little less loudly, even if it doesn't stick. Besides, the ones who can forgive the bitter Februaries and summer's relentless crowding The ones who do not flinch at the cockroaches scuttle across the subway tracks at dawn. Are the ones who do not need to be told that there are as many corners of quiet as there are of honking. That it is possible to be both home and still unknown. to turn a familiar corner and gasp. I have lived here my whole life, but I have never seen this before.